Hey guys, good afternoon. I'm audible. Good afternoon, sir. Yeah, very good afternoon. Okay, guys. So I hope the people are completed uh, practical. Active yourself, guys. Okay, active yourself. Okay, so now let's begin our session today, right? So the last time we completed what um, config server and uh, native server both, and right? Native config, uh, native config, uh, and uh, what? external config server we both we completed and we seen that these things right last time we seen that what refresh scope also right Re refresh scope and uh, i said that ki this one we will see in the next session today we will discuss about what our actuator concept now so everybody is ready now to learn the actuator concept guys yes sir yeah so this is yes, the sir. very this is the very, very important uh, concept, guys. Okay. Actuator also. If you sit in an interview, definitely this question will come to you. Okay. So please uh, carefully. Initially, theory is there. Focus on that. So, may, so much concept is there about what actuator. But before before starting our actuator, is still so such uh, some concept is left about what refresh scope. Because just on that day, we implemented, but how it's working internally, we did not see, right? Yes, sir. So we will see that internal implementation, what is the end point and all those things. So don't worry, so many end point will come and uh, like, but my voice is breaking. Uh, just you uh, push pen your side network issue is there. Hi, Ravi, good afternoon. Yeah, Ravi, now it's fine. Okay, okay. okay. If, if, yeah, good afternoon, Sudhir. Uh, if any if any issue is there, let me know that, right? If any issue is there, please tell me, okay? So now good. <clears throat> so external configuration right so let's uh, talk about a small a small uh let, we will take a, a small amount of time and we will understand what is that refresh scope little bit more then we will uh start working on what actuator right Okay, so now let's start. So refresh scope, right? Refresh scope, we seen that, right? Uh, refresh scope, last time we seen that, what refresh scope now? Okay, good. So at the rate refresh scope, we applied uh, this annotation, right? Yes, Ravi. Refresh scope. refresh scope right this uh, this is internally on what a ready made uh, service guys okay this this refresh scope is what internally what ready made uh, like what end point we can say that what end point because together the our application right our application in whenever where that application now uh, yeah this one right config server uh, uh, config employee config server uh, was there right in that we wrote controller right yes to be on that yeah. on that controller we apply the refresh yeah we applied right, right what is that refresh refresh what annotation at the rate yeah. refresh scope yeah it's actually opening now <clears throat> yeah series refresh scope be applied right yeah yeah Ravi. yeah so just i'm opening this description about this one what is that what is the interface name come on refresh scope. refresh, scope. Re refresh, refresh scope. Scope only. yes refresh scope right so this is this is the end point but its implementation class also will be there guys okay just i want to say if you anybody want just control t control shift t Okay, so here just what? Click. 
रिफ्रेश स्टार इंड पॉइंट रिफ्रेश इंड पॉइंट इज देयर राइट क्लाउड इंड पॉइंट या दिस वन ओनली जस्ट या जस्ट क्लिक ऑन दैट राइट रिफ्रेशिंग राइट internally this what ready made code is executing guys okay internally what is that this is the code whenever we are applying what is that refresh adderet refresh annotation right this code internally is working now so what is that class name now refresh int point come on refresh int point yes, and what my yes, what, what we are calling refresh only na come on just i am opening now see this what we are calling now here refresh <laughs> Come on, yes, refresh, right? Refresh, we are yes, calling sir, or refresh. not? Refresh method. This method we are calling and internally yes, context, sir. context refresh is happening and it's returning. What is that set of strings key and value, right? Set of strings it's returning, right? So this this ready made yes, code sir. we can say in the terms of what? In the the terms of what? Microservices we can say that what end point? Come on, yar. Hmm. Yes, sir. The end point. Yes, sir. end point, right? So, end so, point. but, but the thing is how it's working now, right? What is the internal flow? We need to understand, right? What is the internal flow? Whenever we are applying at the rate refresh scope annotation, right? Internally, how it's working? We need to understand as a diagrammatically. First, we will understand the diagrammatically. Then we will work on so many end point is came, guys. Okay, because actuator concept is there on based on end points only, right? So. So just basic. I'm preparing, guys. Okay. First, we will we will we will discuss about this one. Then we will enter inside the actuator again. After understanding our actuator, we will again come to the same point only, right? Because of that, initially I'm giving some images images inside your brain, right? So just I'm trying to give these images, right? Inside your brain, if these things is there, then you guys will catch up easily actuator concept, right? Yes, sir. Okay, yes, sir. so, 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 just normally, normally, what is the what is the uh, refresh scope, right? Refresh scope is what is that, and what is the internal flow, and how how uh, it's working. We will understand, right? This is what this is. This is internal. Internally, one what is that? Ready made, right? Ready made, ready made what? service service this is ready made service is nothing but what guys end point end point yes ravi end point right end point this is nothing but what end point one so this is what refresh end point we can say that what refresh end point right so how it's working now so just last time we seen that right so this is our database application is there sorry this is our what git is there right inside that git what we are doing now we are storing the key and value right key and Yes, sir. Key and value government. Yes. How it's working now? We will understand that one only, right? So key and value. So here, what is that application property? Just app property. We are right. Application property inside that. Just what is that? Which one is the common key and value? Which one is the common? We are storing those key and value inside this what Git repository, right? That is called what external config. Good. that is called what external config right yes, external config okay yes, so here what we are doing now here here just we are writing our what rest application right this is our what rest application inside this what we are doing no sorry this is our what microservices application right this is our what microservices application inside this microservices application what we are doing now what we are doing now we are writing one what rest controller right just we are doing the coding guys okay just we are doing the coding just we are doing the coding right coding okay. we are doing the coding and uh, on the top of that rest controller class what annotation we are applying now at the rate refresh na come on yaar yes ravi yes ravi at the rate refresh scope at the rate re refresh scope 
at the rate refresh scope whenever we are uh, applying uh, whenever we are applying this annotation on the top of our rest controller what will happen now internally internally which end point will call which end point will call come on just i shown right just we seen that right just we seen that what is that refresh end point come on yaar yes sir internally end point class yes refresh end point right refresh yes refresh end point right refresh yes, end point right refresh end point so uh, inside this refresh end point what is the method now guys which method is calling now which method is calling refresh method na refresh must refresh method only yes refresh method right refresh method right refresh yeah. method then what what will happen now this is the refresh end point whenever we are applying in the inside our microservices what at the rate refresh uh, refresh scope annotation refresh end point is calling right refresh end point is calling and what is that this refresh end point again calling whom again calling whom our config server our what config server right our config server config server okay config server and what our config server what our config server is doing now our config server is interacting with what git repository our config server is interacting with what git repository git repository and what will happen now what will happen now then anybody remember initial day i was when i was explaining what spring core a spring boot core environment environment variable sorry what is the spring environment i so yes sir anybody remember that one today i'm going today that concept is scheme why i explain in core module spring boot core module <laughs> today its usage is there now if anybody is remember those people will enjoy our session who not remember they will just think about what ravi is teaching now right so because of that even i'm giving this much yes, facility sir. the people right after this session i'm updating the videos on youtube channel also right but still the people is becoming lazy i don't know why <laughs> so now what will happen now one our microservices in the container right in the spring container what will happen now what will happen now one one what one our container spring spring container will create what one environment right one environment one yeah. environment so just assume that this is microservices na based on one microservices container will create or not guys come on Yes, yes guys guys in this position again i'm not going to explain what is the container what is the ioc container right because already i completed this uh, area what is the ioc container what is the container in the container how the object is creating how we are making the has a relation how we are auto wiring those things again i'm not going to explain it here guys okay because we are learning the microservices and those concept already i covered if anybody is what confused just what um, watch our core core spring boot core uh, sessions videos right core sessions videos those people will get what clear picture about what container ioc container what is the environment inside the environment which kind of data is storing key and value data is storing right so so in the yes. container in the container because here what is that key and value data is there right so one environment memory will create right one environment environment memory will create right environment memory will create inside that what will happen now inside this inside this what will happen now this data right inside the, this what this data will come right this way data will come right which data will come key and value data will come now okay good yes, yes. so inside that environment memory key and value data will store now right so that is called what that is called if this container right where this one will store that is called what 
by whom whenever we are writing this microservices by whom this this container will create application context anyone remember that when i was explaining explain uh, application context yes sir we application mm -hmm. context only uh, yes. yes yes so that container that yes, container sir. based on that what this is what application context memory will create Context, yes, right? Uh, application okay, context memory will create, and then what will happen now? What will happen now? This data, this data will come to our what microservices? Our microservices, right? This what data. Yes, but here this data will come based on because here we are applying these things inside that what micro sorry config server na config server. So if any changes if we are doing inside that here, just assume that. So here in the conditional based data will come here if the conditional based data will come right if old value is there what we are doing now just just I'm running the same application now guys okay so Puspendra just send me that username and password of our your your git git your git because I need to show that okay. as a practi practically, One right? Minute. Yeah, in the chat box, please send me, right? Please send me just I'm running the same application now. So yes. first, first, which one we will run it now, guys? So first we will run what is spring, but we need to change one one things inside that is spring club because we implemented in the same application or what native server now? Come on. The last time last weekend, guys. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So, yes, yes, native. So here we applied, right? This this code we no, this one is not there, right? One minute. No, employee inside that employee, right? I send it. Yes, okay. So so here see that we wrote this code. Hey, employee now. Okay, yeah, this one. <laughs> Application spring inclusion employee service. Yeah. So Bootstrap. One minute. Mm -hmm. Yeah, config server. Where the config server? We wrote the code inside there because config native. Server, yeah, yeah, in the native code, we need to write in the config server only, right? Cloud Eureka server, and then yeah, this one. Is, yeah, this is the right. Yeah, just opening. I'm opening this. This old file is there, and this one is the new new file new property is there right so inside that what we wrote this code about that what our native config server right yes, yes Ravi. yes good so just what old is there now just backup is just make this one as what backup i'm refactor now rename right just i'm changing because i'm going to use our what external config so backup okay and this one I'm changing as a what? This one I'm changing as a what application? Yeah, we changed it, right? So now in this time, what will happen now? The uh, our what Eureka server will start to communicate. Hey, Puspendra, no need, right? Uh, it is already there. Okay. So in this time, what just what we changed the port number also, right? No need. Okay. So because we already changed the port number now, so it will work. Okay. So now, now in this time, what what will happen now? Again, we will go inside that, right? So just I'm opening Chrome. Yeah, this one only, right? Yes, 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 correct, correct. Yeah, Puspendra is there inside this, right? Come on. People, yes. 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 
एक्टिव योर सेल्फ गाइज ओके एक्टिव योर सेल्फ अदरवाइज द थिंग्स विल नॉट कम टू यू ओके now good so this is the application right so in this time what will happen now sorry what we will do it now uh, switch off your camera what we will do it now who's that please switch off your camera okay so first which application we will run config server right so, uh, eureka server now run the eureka server. Uh, eureka server eureka server run our what eureka server yeah next which application we will run our config server config server next we will run our what microservices our micro yes employee and data right perfect so http colon double slash local host eight one sorry what is that six six one i forgot what is that port number one in it eureka port number can anyone tell i forgot Yes, everyone. Eight seven six one. Yes, yes, yes. Eight seven six one. Yes, call on eight seven six, six one. Six one, right? Yeah, Eureka server is came now, right? Any? Yeah, one instance is running now. Click on that. Today we will talk about that info actuator and all those things. Okay. today our discussion is that one only so here what employee employee slash what data right so here we are getting pushpendra na come on come on people yes, yes sir we pushpendra come yeah yes, so what i am doing now here just here i am changing now right here just i am changing now just i'm making my name only let's take ravi right so now after that commit commit changes i committed right but still i'm refreshing here there is no changes is happening so what we need to do what we need to do we need to refresh right we need to refresh it right using this url actuator slash refresh come on guys yes, yes ravi yeah so just request. yeah yeah so the refresh end point is called right now come here just refresh it then ravi is came right yes ravi yeah ravi yeah so means what now what will happen now if it every time every time what is that whenever we are making the request just think right whenever we are making the request right whenever we are making the request what is that after refreshing right after refreshing this end point what is that the data data if new data is there right if new data if old data is there what if new data is there if new data is there then that new data is loading right this new data is loading inside that environment right environment and then then this one is giving to our our what end point come on 
then this one is giving to our end point right in the real time okay. i will tell how we are implementing right but but uh, if the old value is there if old value is there then that data is already here right that data is already here then every time which data we are getting now old data right come on yes sir yes sir old data only we are getting right old data is get, get we are getting but whenever we are applying the refresh end point so if any modification is happening inside that git right if any modification is happening inside the git what is what will happen now using whenever we are applying the refresh scope what will happen now this end point will call and this one is refreshing to our what config server come on Config server, config server yes, and right. it's collecting right it's collecting what new record new record or new data a new, new value from the git and it's giving to our container in the container the data will store and what is that our container is providing that data to our what microservices now clear microservice come on yes ravi yes ravi yes, ravi clear clear yes. right Yes. Sir. So, yes. but but the thing is, the thing is, is it right? This is uh, every time in the real time, end user will do like this. No, this is the not right. Not right. This is not right approach, not guys. Right. Okay, this is not right approach. Okay. So, how we are implementing in the real time? We are using what a scheduler concept. Anybody remember? Today I'm going to use what scheduling because. After my uh, Spring Boot core, our next module I took what scheduler. Yeah, scheduler cron express. Cron express. Yeah, very good, very good, very good. Today I will use it, right? Today I will use it now. <laughs> okay. So the real time in the real time, how the people are using guys? Okay, because we see here, here we are the real time people. Okay, we are real time people. We, whatever scenario we will take every scenario will be real only if you guys are sitting in interview right if you give like that right the interviewer will uh, if the fake guy also there if he started to giving answer about our like session right how we are uh, explaining the uh, the things and uh, um, whatever things we are delivering to people right if the people is giving like that answer right if that that pe person is not they are maintaining gap experience also right and the people will think about no he is real only because we are learn um, we are learning oh, uh, the subject like that only and one more things guys okay just i decided uh, right because here why we are we are just helping the people right come on uh, please yes, uh, give the response yes ravi uh and uh, last week yes, yes, last weekend we decided because of some uh, other people we will uh, store our videos in cloud right come on yes, yeah guys yes, just, just let's not become narrow minded people let's become open minded people you know so uh, if just assume that because they know that a uh, birth of our subject right so whoever will come with us right we will help her otherwise that teacher also learning with us and if that faculty is delivering our subject to a student forget about that he is taking the money uh, okay because he, uh, he is a money minded person na so but if this kind of subject will reach to will reach to a student just think about that that student career will become good or not Yeah, Ravi. Right. Yeah. So leave yeah, it. it everyone, everyone, karma is there, right, guys? Everything will right. Karma also behind with us is there, na? So God is seeing everything. Don't, don't uh, become narrow-minded. We will post our video on YouTube channel, guys. Okay. Everyone can. If anybody want to join live session, that person also welcome. If no one want, right? They want what to watch our YouTube videos. they mm, that is also welcome right so because one day right one yeah, day right. one day yeah. i was one day i was thinking like that uh, ki uh, see here here i'm not doing businesses with uh, educations right because if my intention is like that i can take uh, the help of any institution because every institution is uh, started to giving me opportunity right but still i'm not holding their opportunity 
so i thought that very nice so you are disciplined so yeah i think it will be reached in mock and sorry so yeah actually yeah. i was joined in another uh, initiative actually uh, so we have discussed about that initiative also okay mm. uh, with the config server they have explained only 10% of uh, what you have discussed <laughs> you are uh, you are giving everything open no? uh, yes <laughs> yeah yes. that's why i accepted last week it is um, good to uh, store it in google drive or save it to our students it's uh, that is that's what even i have accepted right last week yeah, actually, yeah because of that only that, i mean uh, yeah mm. that's a correct only but you know that uh, actually uh, uh, our videos are not uh, like uh, other country people also watching yeah. right so if yeah. if if yeah. we if we make the videos as a private right see uh, we don't know whom we are helping right indirectly right yes so, so this, yeah okay. so if 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 like uh, you know if uh, if we um, like make our video as a private guys okay so maybe those people expectation is there right? we will uh, update the video on youtube channel next concept we will learn from their videos right and because of that even you know guys um, so much senior persons also watching our video in the good good companies one of oracle oracle kind of companies uh, like my manager uh, pinged me right ravikant i'm working in the oracle uh, in the like uh, in this project i am a manager right so like uh, 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 somewhere he heard about that and he uh, said you are planning to like uh, make your video as a private don't do like because of my time uh, actually uh, i am a family member as well as uh, i am a good Uh, in the good position of the company right so because i'm not that i'm not getting time to what join the live session please don't do he's requested to me and he's so much senior uh, to me right but still this kind of people is learning our subject <laughs> i by yeah. listening i became too much so ah, maha that's really a ah, proud proud moment ravi proud really ah. proud ah, oh, sorry now ah. the address image policy and he is one uh, minute hey please Ewa mute yourself if you, you if you are talking address image ipudu fmd ki em em anchu if you are talking on the phone please mute yourself so so uh, and even you know he is also iitn person <laughs> so i thought that ki oh, so because of that i'm thinking okay let's not make our video as a private right let's not make our video as a private and uh, who really need they will use it and who don't need uh, their karma right so at least if the amir pet people also watching our video if they will give what 50% of our subject right knowledge to student uh, forget about they are taking the money uh, don't bother about but uh, if they are giving our subject to a student means what by taking this kind of subject real kind of what real time subject the student can become what little bit good in their career na come on yaar very very true rasa. yes sir very true ah very so true. yeah so right. don't don't bother about that what uh, we are uh, we will we will not make uh, our videos a uh, private or we will not store our videos on a uh, cloud guys okay let's uh, who want they can watch it who don't want their karma you <laughs> know <coughs> yes sir yes ha uh-huh. so you are really proud of you for your uh, attitude and uh, yeah. process in life no actually you know the thing is guys okay if if we not help our people right who will help right everyone is doing a, a, like what a, a business with education and we are seeing that uh, like what is that a jobless people how much jobless and uh, like what so much uh, uh, there is no job after learning what is that after completing their engineering kind of degree guys okay but still they are what roaming in the street only and they are uh, giving uh, like uh, sharing their resume and uh, after uh, getting their resume just what is that there is no skills right <laughs> so at least let's uh, how much we can help the people let's do it na yes ravi yes yes uh, yes Actually, I have spent it also one year in Amirpet. So <laughs> yes, I do. Or I am with you on complete. 
yes no need no need to what i know that uh, in a single time i can't deliver every subject right but whatever subject i will i will deliver guys every subject is useful for you guys okay Na if not today definitely in the future if not today definitely in the future right but definitely definitely that subject and that concept uses will be there in the future if anybody is there in the software industry so definitely so okay so now okay now let's start the session okay let's start the session this 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 thought is came inside my uh, my brain between this week right so i said that okay in the weekend i will tell to my people okay my people what they are telling i will do that one only so this is the my thought process about what uh, making video as a private or not this is the my thought process if anybody want right uh, uh, we will follow because uh, the uh, uh, I, I, alone i can't go anywhere now because you guys are also like if you if the people are listening our sessions means they people are so our only right so everyone uh, perception is need guys okay here everyone perception is need <laughs> okay so real time uh, yeah uh, real time project after microservices we will start real time project right real time project only we will start on the microservices only uh, our uh, real time project also will be there on microservices data jp and the front end if uh, based on your expectation if you guys are uh, telling me front front end user like okay. what angular js or jquery in both both framework if any any framework if you uh, tell 